fight between Robert Whitaker and Drakus Duplessis will not be close. Robert Whitaker has a wealth of experience in the UFC. Having fought against some of the best middleweights in the world, he is a former middleweight champion and has defeated fighters such as Yoel Romero, Marvin Vittori, Jared Cannonier. Whitaker's striking skills are exceptional and he has proven to be a dangerous opponent on the feet. In contrast, Drakus Duplessis is a relative newcomer in the UFC. He has only five fights in the organization and has only faced two semi-topped ranked opponents. While he's a good record of 19 and two, his lack of experience in the octagon could be a major disadvantage against someone as seasoned as Whitaker. Secondly, Whitaker has a well-rounded game. With an excellent grappling and takedown defense, he has demonstrated his ability to stuff takedowns and control the pace of the fight on the ground, which could pose a challenge for Duplessis, who has a strong grappling background. Whitaker's cardio is outstanding, allowing him to maintain a high pace throughout the fight. He has gone five rounds in multiple occasions and has not shown any signs of slowing down in the latter rounds. This could be crucial in a matchup against Duplessis, who has not gone past the third round in any of his UFC fights. Finally, Whitaker has a significant height and reach advantage over Duplessis. Whitaker is 6 feet tall with a reach of 73 inches, while Duplessis is 5'11 with a reach of 72 inches. This can make it challenging for Duplessis to close the distance and land strikes, allowing Whitaker to use his range to pick apart the opponent from the outside. In conclusion, while there are no guarantees in the UFC, Robert Whitaker's experience is well-rounded and has more physical advantage over Duplessis, which can potentially leave him into a victory over him.